Hello and welcome to Amorca Computer and Web Solutions, a computer repair, web design and SEO company. My name is Amor and I will be your host for today's Amorca tutorials. Please note that you can find free window tips and computer articles by visiting our website at amorca.com. Uh, if you have any questions or comments, please email us at videotutorials at amorca.com. Please enjoy. In today's tutorial, we'll be talking about the MBR3 air message that you might get after installing a Cronus uh, OS uh, selector. Of course, we're just going to go through the option of resolving the issue. And uh, to do that, you will need to bring up your uh, the uh, Acronis uh, true image what we have here and as you can see we do have the uh, uh, the home 2009 uh, edition installed uh, we did not see any reason to upgrade to the latest version the one we have the 2009 uh, does exactly what we wanted to do so again no sense of upgrading when you don't really have to now we have the window open so what we do is we click on the tools and then we click on the activate Acronis Startup Recovery Manager. Once you click on that you're going to get a window and for our case here uh, because uh, our uh, startup recovery is already uh, activated that's why we have this option to deactivate the startup recovery or the Acronis uh, Startup Recovery. Uh, but if you are still receiving the MBR3 error, chances are you will get uh, the activate option. So when you see that, just go ahead and click on it, and then uh, it will take uh, like maybe 5 or 10 seconds to go through the process and complete. You're going to get the window uh, that it will say uh, the uh, Acronis Startup Recovery was successfully uh, activated. And all you do is you actually go ahead and close that window and the Acronis uh, True Image uh, Home Edition. Then you can just go ahead and uh, reboot uh, the PC. Uh, once you reboot, you should not see that uh, error uh, on your screen. Now, if you go to our website, which is amorca.com here, and uh, you look uh, at the uh, left menu here, Okay, uh, click on the free computer tips. Okay, now uh, on that page you're going to go ahead and see the uh, how to resolve your MBR error 3 error message. Okay, so you click on that link, it will expand. Click on the read more link and you're going to land uh, on the page where it's going to give you more information about the uh, MBR error 3 uh, message. Um, it's going to uh, give you the, the name of the files that were actually uh, affected by the uh, Windows Vista and Windows 7 uh, uh, boot optimization. And also we have the, the uh, step to resolve the issue just like uh, we did. And then you have the another step that you can take to resolve the issue, you know, uh, in the future. So what you do there is you actually uh, create a small partition dedicated for the Acronis uh, OS selector, small partition of uh, no, no less than 10 max, okay? anything but no less than uh, 10 max. Okay, so you create that partition. Then you go ahead and uninstall the Acronis uh, OS selector. You reboot the PC. Uh, you log back in. You start the installation of the Acronis uh, OS uh, selector. Uh, but uh, remember, uh, it's going to ask you for the path as to where you want to install it. Just go ahead and select the uh, the new uh, partition path that you selected. Uh, I'm sorry that you created earlier. So, and you should be fine. You should not be receiving the uh, the uh, the error message again. 
The tutorial has been brought to you by Amor at Amor Computer and Web Solutions, a computer repair, web design, and SEO company. Please visit us at amorca.com for more free Windows uh, hacks and tips and also for free computer articles. Thank you for watching Amorca Tutorials and hope to see you again soon. Till next time, I wish you a great day.